and four of a tour, and he'll, he'll float it forward. Puck comes up to Pellerin. He'll move it up the wall. Pellerin gets it back. Backhand save made by Rucci. Lowell on the ice. Puck now on the ice. Squires in deep, and Eagles with four in deep, and that might cause some problems here as Frenette coming in the other way. Odd man rush. Frenette coming in, holding pass to the front of the net. Deegan pass to the front shot. Scores, and the puck was low on the ice, and it's put in on the rebound by the pinching defenseman, Vincent Sevigny. And I mentioned when Squires disjointed odd man rush, the pass to Sevigny didn't really result in a high opportunity as he was the trailer in the three-on-one. He actually ended up jabbing it off the pads of Ruccia, and then he just picked up his own rebound. So the Teague take a one to nothing lead. So a defenseman pinches on one end, allowing the odd man rush, and it's a defenseman that gets onside. Bluan drop pass for Michaud's shot, goes wide of the goal. Golov trying to jab at it. Boy, he managed to get a stick on the puck in the air. And holding. Flips it over to Pellerin. Now Frenette for Sevigny. Sevigny over to Cormier. Good puck movement here. Frenette shot, scores. Connor Frenette as the Teague stretching the Eagles out. If you have, you have the opportunity to do that, Fournette was between the circles, and he ends up finishing the play. And that looked like a set play as Fournette turned his body all the way around, passed it to Sevigny at the point. Sevigny, the pass on the right side to the right circle, comes back. Stop Lowell on the ice. Puck comes back now to Cormier. Swing pass. And it comes to Sevigny again at the blue line. Sevigny cross ice for Cormier. Oh, alone he scores. Tommy Cormier finding himself on the right circle. And he puts it by Ruccia. Victoria, they lead. JCB. Take the draw. Draw one by the Eagles. Pellerin will skate it in, though, as Victoriaville takes possession. What a move by Cormier! Save made by Rucci. A boy, some very adept stick handling there. Up the right wing, Eagles 20-year-old Ford. Moves it forward for Ivan Ivan. Ivan for Gerard. Gerard coming in. Top left circle. Pass for Ivan in traffic. Ivan Deacon back in. Scores! And I'd have to say, when Gerard passed to Ivan in traffic, I thought he was in too tight to make any moves. But never bet against the check forward. He came in, pulled to his backhand, put it low along the ice, past Nicholas Hurtabies, and that is a big goal. Bubbles it, gets it back, gets it to Trenholm. Trenholm will hustle into the Victoriaville zone. Trenholm still with it. Pass to Canning, pitching in, shot, oh! Big save there on the uh, blocker side. Puck there to Pellerin. Pellerin moves it forward for Cormier. Tommy Cormier up the left wing. Looks for Pellerin. Pass in front to Pellerin. He scores. Boy, actually Pellerin all alone at the side of the net. And the first pass to Pellerin, he was like he just stood in the same place and the play came back to him. As Cormier made a pass off the left circle, Cormier couldn't pick it up. The puck went behind the net, bounced out to the other wing and Cormier all of a sudden had a tap in. And boy, this Victoriaville power play running amok here in Sydney tonight. He Intermission, like hearing about the big names and the other two loops in the CHL. Here's Sevigny down the left side looking for Nadeau. Nadeau has it at center point. Hill shoots, scores! Shot from the point by Alexander Nadeau. Goes through a screen and the Teague take a 5-1 to one lead. And Nadeau will lead the celebration to the benches. We'll take another break. You're listening to Uniglass Plus, Cambridge Eagles Hockey, 1270 CJCB. Sevigny up the left wing. Sevigny drops it back for Cormier. Cross there. Pass in front. They score. It's going to be a tip in as the pass was coming in hot across the ice from Olivier Coulomb. And Connor Frenette taps in his second of the night. To one with 35.4 seconds remaining here in period number two. Shots for Trenholm. Trenholm up the left wall. Drop pass for Hagerty. Oh, shot to save. Rebound. Gerard. Oh, denied. What an opportunity for Nicholas Gerard. Would have been limping hard to try to finish this shift. Puck comes back to Pellerin. And finally, De Rochelle will go to the bench. Frenette now has Cormier driving the net. Frenette towed right past to Cormier. Oh, big save by Arucha. And he'll cover for a faceoff. He'll move the puck up the right wall. Ends up turning it over. Coulomb holding. Coulomb, cross there for Daigle. A shot scores. Boy, that just got up and over. Nicholas Ruccia on the trapper side. and We'll take a break. You're listening to Uniglass Plus. Cape Breton Eagles Hockey, 1270 CJCB.
Trenholm's shot goes wide to the goal. Hager de Obaz after it. Hager de Obaz drops it back now for La Rochelle. La Rochelle, center point. Shot scores! Shot La Rochelle! Shot through traffic against his old team. That's a special one for Sean La Rochelle, regardless of the circumstances. So much of his career in Victoriaville, three special years. Rose driving the net. Gorinoff shot goes off the skate of Shortle, and he's going to feel that one as the puck comes out to the front of the net. Gorinoff shot scores, and both of the Russians have hit the score sheet tonight for Victoriaville. Finds the back of the net, and a rough uh, time for Nicholas Ruccia, facing a lot of quality opportunities. And it's not often you'll see a team allow eight goals, three games in a row. Liam Kidney coming to town, draw one by Victoriaville. Cam Bulldoop blows a tire, Jack Campbell coming up the right wing. Pass over to Canning, oh, and he scores! Jack Campbell tried to make the pass to Canning. Well, Jack Campbell will take it. And the Eagles get on the board here. As uh, it is an 8-3 score. And Lucas Canning doesn't have any goals this season, so I know Campbell was probably trying to get him going, but he'll take the goal. Face-off will come at center.